The KHSAA Board of Control voted last May to award the Girls Sweet 16 tournament to Northern Kentucky University in 2016 and 2017. It's a tradition on the Hill that's going to be missed by both the campus and the community. Between the restaurants and the attractions and the hotels, it, it is a big boost to the economy. A boost to the tune of nearly $1 million. But organizers say the Sweet 16 is about more than money. You can't replace the idea of the Houchins Industries Girls Sweet 16. This is the, the nostalgia. Um, this is an event all in itself, and it, it brings so many things to our community. And we felt like we owned it. It's, it's like losing one of our family members. Andy Wagner has run the scoreboard for the tournament since the first year it came to Diddle in 2001. He's heartbroken the event is moving. I hope that in a couple of years we'll be able to get it back here um, because I think we do a top-notch program here. Each year the teams are paired with a host family in Bowling Green. If they need a doctor, they need a dentist, they need whatever place to practice or whatever, that's our job to help them out. We will definitely miss it. There's not a, anything that will fill that spot at this point, but hopefully we can get it back. Uh, we really do. WKU has worked closely with the KHSAA and the Convention and Visitors Bureau to make sure everything runs smoothly. So many of the kinks have been worked out since it's been here for so long. We put our best foot forward for all these visitors on campus. Indeed, it's a huge recruiting opportunity. And with the amount of fans that follow some of these teams, Cardwell says this final tournament at Diddle could be the biggest yet. Typically, you are around 50,000 in attendance for the event, but like this year's lineup stands to uh, surpass that. We'll go out with a great bang, and that's that's the idea. We want to, we want them to miss us. The tournament got underway yesterday and in Sunday afternoon with the championship game. Cardwell says WKU will be bidding to have the Girls Sweet 16 return to Diddle Arena. With this week's View from the Hill, I'm Amy Bingham.